All right, and what you see here is a new fan I got from the anonymous eBay seller. This is a Hampton Bay Landmark 3 Plus. It's either the Landmark 3 or the Landmark Plus. They called them both throughout the year, so I'm just calling it the Landmark 3 Plus. Um, yeah, this is my second Landmark 3 Plus in 52 inches. Um, I've been wanting to get one in this finish for a while, along with the polished brass one, which is actually the last one I need to find now. Um, yeah, this one I got off him, um, he got a few of them. One he's keeping, one's being parted out because it's just in, in such bad condition, it's also missing a ton of parts. And then there's this one that he cleaned up pretty well, de-warped the, the blades, and yeah, so I ended up buying this one off him because he wanted to keep the one without the white kit. I had a disappointing switch cap on it. And I like these a lot with the whites, so I figured I'd get this one. These fans are major childhood fans for me. Um, all three of them in each finish. Same with the 42 inch one in white. Um, these are basically the most basic fans you could buy at Home Depot back then. And I, they still sell the, the polished brass one online, if I'm not mistaken. So if I was to find a polished brass one, I'd rather get one that's actually older, not a new one. And such. I mean, it would make for a good comparison. The difference in quality, but I feel like it's honestly not gonna be that much of a difference. Um, yeah, my favorite version is obviously the polished brass one and the white one. The energy grass one I like a lot, but it's definitely my. I like the white one and the polished brass one equally, whereas this one's my second favorite. But I still like it a lot. And it's nothing really special in terms of quality, but it's a fan that I remember seeing from my childhood at Home Depot. And yeah. So they just, I remember the white one was the first one they discontinued, and then they discontinued the, the antique brass one. Around 2010, I think, was when they discontinued it. Because the one that uh, my buddy ended up parting out, that I got this from, um, that one was actually from 2009, and it was around that time period that he started to kind of slowly phase them out a bit after the um, Glendale came out. But, um, yeah, it's in really good shape. Um, has oak blades that reverse the walnut. I like that this has walnut blades on it and not rosewood because I feel like walnut suits it antique brass better than rosewood does. And I feel like rosewood goes a lot better with polished brass. The top needs to be a little bit clean, but it's not a big deal. Um, yep, here's the information. April of 2006 is when this fan was made. Made by SMC, obviously. There's another little UL sticker that says um, March 2005, but I'm going by the the SMC one. That's just the UL one. I mean, it does give me an idea of when it was like starting to be manufactured, but yeah, it's just, it's one of the few fans that they sold going into the group downs that still had a um uh I guess a basic look like you see like in the 80s and 90s the only real thing that kind of makes it look newer is that it has panama vents like oh not panama vents that it has doesn't have cane blades but basically it looks like a fan you'd see from like the 80s era and such and 90s which is why a lot of people like these uh, including myself but um yeah, it's missing pull chains, but like, and the glass is not original. It's actually the spare set that I had. But, um, I have pull chains I can put on it that are identical to what this would have used. I can just steal them off my antique brass and to be chat them. But, um, yeah, I finally got an antique brass one for pretty, very cheap. It was like a friendly bundle deal. He found this at a habitat, and like I mentioned in other videos, he got stuff that he can either keep, sell, or part out and i tend have tend to buy some of the stuff off him that i'm interested in so yeah so yeah that'll be it for this video thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more videos to come